Hello and welcome to the Kenneth Cameron Law Office Legal Podcast, looking at recent cases and here we look at State versus Barros, where the appellate court held the post-conviction relief motion may be available where the trial attorney provided wrong advice. In this case, uh, the court uh, um, applied Padilla versus Kentucky, the U.S. Supreme Court case, and affirmed the grant of post-conviction relief based upon the defense, defendant's assertion that his uh, 2008 attorney did not advise him that his guilty plea in 2008 to drug distribution charges subjected him to mandatory deportation. The uh, Supreme Court had granted uh, the um, state's petition for certification and remanded um, this case in light of the uh, Supreme Court's case of State v. Gayton, which held that the U.S. Supreme Court Padilla case announced a new rule applicable only to guilty pleas entered after Padilla was decided. However, in light of Gayton, the court reversed the, uh, the grant of the post-conviction but stayed the judgment to allow the defendant to seek, post uh, to seek habeas corpus relief in federal court in light of the Third Circuit decision in the case United States v. Orocio, O-R-O-C-I-O. Let's see. Um, and that's State versus Barrow. So for post-conviction cases dealing with immigration issues, read the whole case. Citation 525 NJ Super 329 Appellate Division 2012. For other uh, criminal information, visit website njlaws.com or website benotguilty.com. That's B-E not guilty.com. For... Uh, representation, contact the lawsuit Kenneth for Cameron at 732-572-0500. Thank you and good luck.